Great morning, great morning. So this morning when I was working out, I heard clear as day, profit over passion equals neglecting purpose. Yes, profit over passion equals neglecting purpose, meaning that whatever it is that you're called to do, if you have a business, if you're serving someone, I'll use myself for example, um, as far as a coach, and I had this issue in the past, I'm just gonna be honest, is when you're so focused on how many clients can you can get, because you're looking at the profit, you're looking at the hidden sales more than you're looking at the transformation, the souls, um, the lives that's gonna be changed from the service, that, for the gift that God has placed inside of you. Because this is what you have to understand, what God has placed inside of you, that gift, that passion, is what he has created you for. It is your purpose. And so I remember um, hearing, clear as day, Dr. Miles Monroe speak about how um, purpose is, when purpose is unknown, then abuse is inevitable. So when you're so focused on profit more than the lives of someone being changed, and that's when your purpose starts to um, become a abused. I'm not saying if you're in business, don't um, have, you know, like your quota or your goals as far as your business um, to reach your goal. I'm not saying either of that. So, you know, don't misconstrue it. However, what I mean is that if you are someone, whether it's if you have a restaurant, if you're a coach, whatever you're, you're doing to help change and impact the lives of others, that has to be greater for the impact and change of their life has to be your focus more than a dollar sign as far as what you're going to get behind it. And I just want to um, share this with you. Um, because the Lord placed on my heart to share this. Um, just for an example, um, there are some pastors, apostles, and people in the church where um, this is happening a lot, that the profit is greater than the passion, the thing that God has placed inside of them, the gift, and therefore, um, the purpose of what God has placed inside of them is being abused. So I remember sitting down with this um, apostle one time, and to be honest, I went to the church because I needed help with my rent. Um, I had such a poverty mindset, lack, finances was just all out of whack and everywhere and so I went to them to get help for my rent right and what I needed it was on a Sunday and I needed it by 875 by Friday and as I sat down I talked to him and we went over my finances here I am a mother of three single mother of three and when he saw that all of my finances most of it was going to the church he looked at me and he said that you don't want to change this you don't want to change this, but I'm coming to the church and I need help to pay my rent. But you see, most of my finances are going to the church. That's not a way of budgeting. And the only reason why that happened is because the profit had became greater than the, pa the, the passion, the purpose for why God placed him in the position that he placed him in. So therefore now th there is abuse behind that. And so now the dollar sign is greater than the lives, the impact as far as um, other there's lives been changed and so now when I say this now because I believe in the church I believe in the community and so it's not to put all pastors and apostles and preachers all in the same category but the Lord did place on my heart for me um, to share that I've only just hoped and prayed in the process I did have to heal and forgive and just hope that you know that's something that has changed um, you know, with them specifically. And just anyone, um, you know, in the church or whatever you're doing, um, I just want to challenge you and encourage you this morning to really look at yourself and examine and say, am I in a place in my life right now where I'm looking at the profit greater than the passion, than the purpose of why God called me to do this? You have to understand, and I think about the scripture that says, in all that you do, do it as into excellence of the Lord. When you are operating in purpose, you're doing it as into excellence of the Lord, the passion, the impact, the change that's going to happen because when you do that and you operate in such a form then that's when God's glory God's presence get to um, operate in the earth realm through you how awesome is that how awesome is that so again I just want to encourage you and remember profit greater than passion equals neglecting purpose it means you've come to a place where you're looking at the dollar sign more than what you were created to do. And now, therefore, the purpose of why God created you, there, um, there's it's been abused. It's been abused. So I hope that this word encouraged someone. If you believe it kept others, please share and have an amazing day on purpose.